Now I'm very pleased to be able to introduce the Chancellor of our university system, Brett Kerwin. He has been the Chancellor since 2002. Previously, he served as President of Ohio State University and the University of Maryland prior to that, where he was a member of Maryland's faculty, a mathematician, for 24 years. Dr. Kerwin chairs the National Research Council Board of Higher Education and Workforce and the College Board's Commission on Access, Admissions, and Success in Higher Education. He also co-chairs the Knight Commission on Intercollegiate Athletics. He's received the Carnegie Corporation Leadership Award in recognition of his commitment to excellence in undergraduate education and the TIAA Kraft Theodore Heisberg Award for Leadership Excellence. A top higher education honor, this award recognizes his leadership and commitment to higher education and contributions to the greater good. Ladies and gentlemen, Chancellor Britt Kerwin. Thank you very much, uh, Margaret, for that a very warm in introduction. Uh, you've been a very patient audience. I will be very brief, succinct, if you would. Uh, I just want to make uh, three points. First, um, this is to, not to the higher education community, but to other Marylanders. I think you should feel an enormous sense of pride in what we're celebrating today. In order to get this award, the competition was extraordinary. And keep in mind, only one such award was made this year. But to get it, we, had, we were up against Columbia, Stanford, the University of California, Berkeley, and other institutions of, of that ilk. One award for $25, 6000000 million being given. I think the way for Marylanders to understand this is thinking about what's going to occur this weekend. We just won the Environmental Super Bowl. <laughs> I just want to say kudos to Margaret and Don Bosch for putting together such a fabulous team uh, that could create a proposal that could win in this kind of, of uh, competition. The second point I want to make is, and, and other, others have referenced this, is how this award brings together not just three institutions in the University System of Maryland, uh, UMC's College Park and Coppin, but universities across the country, Michigan, uh, Washington State, and other universities, but not just in the United States, from Sweden and from Germany. I mean, this is a global effort all focused right here in Annapolis. What an extraordinary thing. And it's not just these different universities, it's all the disciplines that are coming together uh, to work on this one issue of the environment and how we can um, survive and prosper uh, in this age of uh, climate change. What especially meant a lot to me was that is in describing the, the various disciplines that would be represented in this building, did you hear them say mathematicians would be in here? <laughs> I am so glad the world is finally finding out that we can do something useful. <laughs> My final point is uh, to thank, of course, our, 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 our wonderful senator because she's been such a champion of, of science and, and um and, and the environmental issues for so many years. I also want to recognize uh, Governor O'Malley because this is literally true. The first day of his appointment as governor, selection, uh, selection as governor, he announced that the environment and climate change would be one of his signature I initiatives. The first commission he appointed after becoming governor was on climate change. He has been at this for the entire time of his term, and he isn't letting go. So, Governor, this is the fruition of the leadership and inspiration that you have provided to us. And let me just say that our the, the, the members of the General Assembly, the President of the Senate, imagine another state where the President of the Senate and the Speaker of the House would come to an event like this. This shows what their commitment is to this very critical uh, issue. And then let me just c conclude by, 
by thanking uh, Director Suresh. Now, just think about this for a folk, uh, moment, folks. How many awards do you think the National Science Foundation gives out every year? Thousands. Can he go to every single award? <laughs> no. This man came here. That shows you how important he thinks this particular ward is in this, this century. So I want to thank you, uh, Director Suresh, not only for your presence here today, but for the leadership you provide to the National Fa uh, Science Foundation and the focus you are bringing to the critical issues of our day, like environmental sustainability. Our pledge to you in Maryland is that we are going to do everything in our power to make this the best environmental center NSF ever created. Thank you very much. <laughs>